This is just me hearing about a patient and saying, huh, I'm not sure what's going on. And the questions I'm asking of GPT now four are the kinds of questions that if I ran into my favorite, in this case, either infectious disease doctor or hep hepatologist, liver specialist, in the cafeteria, I'd say, Can, let me run a case by you quickly. He presented with a fever, uh, shortness of breath, and a cough, was found to have pulmonary infiltrates. We started him on Zosin, and then he was noted to have abnormal LFTs with a pattern of an AST, ALT of about 1,200, and a normal bilirubin and alkaline phosphatase. Uh, what do you think might be going on with his liver? It sounds like your patient could be experiencing drug-induced liver injury, DILI, possibly from the Zosin, piperacillin tazobactam. Given the dramatic rise in AST and ALT with normal bilirubin and alkaline phosphatase, it suggests hepatocellular injury. Other potential causes to consider include viral hepatitis, ischemic hepatitis, especially if he had a period of hypotension or a flare of his underlying condition. You might want to discontinue the suspected medication and consider further diagnostic workup, including viral serologies, liver imaging, and potentially a liver biopsy if the diagnosis remains unclear. Thanks very much. That makes a lot of sense. We also thought Dilly was the most likely diagnosis, but here was the rub. Uh, his abnormal LFTs were noted about six hours after the first dose of the Zosin, and we wondered whether that timing was okay or is that too fast. What do you think? The rapid onset of liver enzyme elevation within six hours of starting Zosin does seem unusually fast for typical drug-induced liver injury, which usually takes days to weeks to manifest. This rapid change could suggest another cause, such as ischemic hepatitis, which can present with a rapid and significant increase in AST and ALT levels following a hypotensive episode. It's essential to review the patient's hemodynamic status and any recent events that might have caused liver hypoperfusion. Also, consider acute viral hepatitis or other acute liver insults as part of the differential diagnosis. That's very helpful. Thanks so much. Can you uh, tell me a, a short poem about Dilly, about drug-induced liver injury? Thank you. Sure, here's a short poem about drug-induced liver injury. A drug prescribed to heal and mend, in rare cases, may offend. The liver, strong, begins to falter. With enzymes rising, health can alter. A silent thief with stealthy tread turns the liver shades of red. Hepatocytes in distress cry, stop the cause or we may die. Yet knowledge shines, a guiding light, to cease the drug and set things right. With careful watch, the liver mends. The patient's health, the story ends. That's fabulous. Thanks so much.